Are you at odds with your spouse when it comes to money? We know that money is a big issue in the harmony or the discord of a marriage. It's not just about the numbers. So often it's one partner is a spender and the other is a saver. One has career goals and the other is still finding their way. What do you do if one person is more security oriented and the other one is willing to take more risks? One couple we worked with, Trent and Sarah, we're, not just, we're just not on the same page. They love one another and their kids, but their goals for the future versus the present were far apart. Trent's a risk taker. He doesn't worry if he might lose some money. He believes that the potential for reward is there. That makes Sarah nervous. She likes to think of their money in small bits like household and college and vacations. Trent's a big picture guy. and He figures there's going to be enough money as long as he keeps working hard and can earn it. When they came to see us, it was hard to know where to start. We spent a lot of time on their desires for the future and how they wanted to communicate. We used some of our tools during our SMART process to help them with that. We take a lot of time modeling where their present position is before we ever make a recommendation for any changes. We also look at where they might be losing money unnecessarily, including Uncle Sam. It may seem detailed, and even like a slow start, but what we see is over and over, those two partners start to move closer and closer together and get on the same page through lots of opportunities for dialogue. Although our primary job is about helping them achieve their financial objectives, Trent and Sarah felt like the smart process really helped bring them together, brought them closer, and they were able to look at money and its moving parts better as a family. I'm Jason Lee, the Vice President of Smart Group Houston. Check out our website for more details. Thanks.